that caused some very strange. Yeah, that was they're tied to something. Can we break these chains? Chains of love. Oh, hey, is that the mirror? Cool. What? Oh my God! Her face is covering up the entire screen, man. She's crazy. Uh, but first comes the anger, then comes the depression. Ew. Yeah, I know. Well, what? Who are these guys? dark entity looks in the twilight. It houses an evil power. You who are guided by fate, you who possess the crest of the goddesses, hear us. At the command of the goddesses, we sages have guarded the mirror twilight since ancient times. You seek it, but the mirror twilight has been fragmented by mighty magic. Not mighty guard? That magic is a dark power that only he possesses. Oh, Zant? Do we need to kick his ass then? His name is... Yes? Ganondorf! Oh, there's a big surprise! That's an incredible- I think I'm gonna have a heart attack and die from that surprise! Ho 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 ha! Yeah, like, who didn't see this coming? He was the leader of a band of thieves who invaded Hyrule in the hopes of establishing dominion over the Sacred Realm. What else is new there? He was known as a demon thief. Man. You know, I wonder if Ganon's horse has a name. Has anybody ever wondered that? Like, he has a horse, and but the horse doesn't have a name. In all of his fury and might, he was blind to any danger, and thus was he exposed, subdued, and brought to justice. Oh my. You better be scared, because, like... Aw... Uh, sword. Oh, that sounded painful. Yeah. I don't know, man. Uh, I don't care if it is a bad guy. Still attacking someone while they're defenseless is really cowardly, if you ask me. <laughs> but, like I said before, it is a bad guy, but still it has to be you know, if you're gonna kill him, just freaking do it. Don't tie him up and do it. Make a big spectacle of it. Oh no! By some divine prank, he too had been blessed with the chosen power of the gods. And guess what? Ugh! Holy mackerel! <laughs> yeah, you better get away with your detached faces. Jeez, it looks like Balrog and Zang Jeez had a kill. Oh, he's scary. I actually like this incarnation of Ganondorf. He looks really good in this game. He looks, you know, in Wind Waker, he was all, like, fat and stuff, but... But in this game, he really, he looks really, you know, menacing and, like, pretty... You know, honest guy, he's not somebody you'd want to run into on the street. Ooh. So I guess he's getting banished now? Yeah. What do you figure? I heard someone say before that this is what happened while Link was off in, uh... Oh, in Termina. But I'm not sure. And then the Link that shows up in this game would be like a... A time-traveling... Like, I don't know. I, I, like I said, I don't have a theory about any of that, of, of the timeline. I've never really... I just haven't studied enough to really know. You know, because I know people bring up details, like even the smallest of details in the games, and use that to come up with their theories, but I don't... I just don't know that much about it. Like, I don't know it the way that I know Lost. I don't just have it all memorized, really. Hmm. So Zant couldn't destroy the mirror because he didn't have the power to do that, because, because that would have been cheating. Now they're telling us where the other three temples are. One in the heavens, the other two were Sacred Grove and uh, Snow Peak. Obviously, I haven't mentioned that several times now. <laughs> Fragment? 
Let's go get him. All right. Is it always nighttime here during this cussing? I can't remember. So yeah. Not so much for the mirror. Can't do much about that. So we got to go get the other three fragments and complete the mirror, and that'll be the end of the game, almost. But uh, look at these columns falling here. <laughs> yeah. So uh, we got a couple things that we're gonna need to take care of on the way out of here. We make sure we don't miss anything. But for now, I think I'm just gonna go ahead and cut this off because uh, oh, you know what? We don't even need to. See, a lot of this always happens. Like every single time I play through this game, this happens. I come back out here into this room, and I start playing around with a spinner, and I forget like where I'm supposed to go or how I get out of here. Okay, but see, what you're supposed to do is just go outside and warp. I'm pretty sure, because there's no other way out of here. So now you can get back out to the desert again. But there was a Poe that was actually outside of the temple that I never got a chance to get because it wasn't nighttime, so I want to go see if I can find that, but man, it's going to take a while to get over there. And it could very well turn to daytime before we get there. But I'm going to try for that, and if I can't get it, then we'll just do it in the next video. Otherwise, I'm pretty much done with this segment, so. Wait, what? The fences are back up? No, I was going to say. They can't be back up. They could not have rebuilt them that fast. I can't believe I got here this fast. Anyway, like I said, the pole over here, you can see it from here. So. Get in my circle, baby. Alright, now look at all the levers. Holy crap. I like what I'm sipping into my balls. Okay, we're out of here. They'll be chasing me. Okay, there's one more Poe in the desert, but it's really far from here. Or there might be more Poe than just one left to get in the desert area, but still. Ah, I see him. Sure enough, he's right here. And, uh... Yep. No problemo. Boom! I like it when I'm sniffing it into my balls. What is this digging spot over here? It looks like it goes into a cave. Wait, where, where was it? Oh man, I just barely got him before daytime. Ooh, it does go somewhere. Yeah, I might as well check it out before we cut off of here. Holy crap. <laughs> I suppose that's one way you can do this. Look at the hearts. Man, I can't see nothing in here. Hang on a second. Oh, wait, I'm not human. <laughs> okay, here we go. Man, that snow. Oh, it's just crunching. Man, I had no idea there were so many spiders in here. Holy crap. Again, I say, if you're scared of bugs, you're better off... Oh, my God. Hang on a second. Let me just... No, don't put up... Ugh. I was trying to put away my sword, not put out the... Okay, one at a time, one at a time. Yeah, you gotta wait till he's attacking like that first, I guess. It's just like the Skull Kid, you have to wait till he's blowing the horn. <laughs> but, there's a treasure here. If this is 100 rupees, I swear to God, I'm gonna just... I don't even know what I'm gonna do. And I'm pretty sure that's what it is, because if this was a piece of heart, I would've remembered this. It is 100 rupees! And guess what? It won't fit in your wallet, so let's put it back. Oh my god. You gotta be kidding me, man! Okay. Well, it was fun while it lasted, but all good things must come to an end, and so must this video. So thanks everybody for watching, and I will see you next time on Let's Play Twilight Princess. Take care, and uh, see you in another life. <laughs>